Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel. I am Carmen J. Ponce and I'm here today to demonstrate how to thread the sewing machine. Are you ready? So let us start now threading the machine head. Okay, so first we need to place the thread to the thread holder. Then hold the end of the thread, insert properly to the thread guide. And get the thread down to the spool pin. So this is the spool pin. Now after threading, we need to put the end of the thread to the two holes thread guide. Sometimes this is three holes thread guide. From top down, then top down. Okay? Then we have to insert the thread to the upper tension. So you have the two plate, two plates. So we need to insert the thread properly at the center. Yeah. Then proceed to the lower tension. Then go up the thread to the arm thread guide. Insert the thread to the arm thread guide. Ooh. Now Hold the end of the thread, then insert to the thread take up lever. Then get the thread to the left side. Then down to the face plate thread guide. So you have to insert the thread properly to the face plate thread guide. Okay. And we have also the spring. You have to insert also the thread to the spring. Then insert to the needle bar eyelet. Then get the end of the thread. Then the last part, of course, the needle eye. Insert the thread to the needle eye. Here you go. Now, after the step-by-step -step threading the machine head, let us uh, record. Okay. First, we need to place the thread to the thread holder. Then the thread go up, insert to the thread stand hole. Then down to the spool pin. Then go to the two holes thread guide. Then you have to insert the thread to the upper tension at the center down to the lower tension and go up to the arm thread guide then passing to the thread take up lever then from the thread take up lever down to the face plate thread guide then we have the spring then insert to the uh, needle bar thread guide or eyelet then needle eye so that is the last part of threading the machine head now after threading the machine head we need to prepare for the lower thread so you have a bobbin case and then the bobbin but for the technique for the bobbin case for winding the bobbin for the thread it should be 80% only huwag niyong gagawing 100% you will be encountered some problem while you are sewing now, this time, we have to insert the bobbin to the bobbin case. Then, locate the slit. Then, proceed to the latch. Like this. Then, make it sure. Piyaki na hindi ito nalalaglag. Okay? Just in case you have encountered some problems while... Um, inserting the bobbin to the bobbin case you need to adjust the hook to tighten and loosen now to insert the bobbin and bobbin case we need to adjust or remove slightly the machine bed slide okay look at the position of the bobbin and bobbin case 
this is should be at the top not like this this is wrong it should be like this okay okay so this is the part that you can insert the bobbin and bobbin case so hold on check the position of the bobbin and bobbin case okay so you have to observe this it should be at the top So, dapat marinig niyo yung click. Now, once you once you hear the click, meaning to say that the bobbin and bobbin case are properly inserted. Now, let us uh, go back to the machine head. So, this, we need to close. Okay. We need to close the machine bed. Like this. Now, let us uh, prepare to get the lower thread. Hold the thread from the machine head. Okay. Now, rotate the balance wheel to lower the needle to get the lower thread. Okay. Then you have to press the knee lifter to to raise up the pressure foot here you go and we have the lower thread okay so this is the thread from the machine head and this is the thread from the bobbin and bobbin case so ready to sew the thread must be away from the operator should be at the back of the pressure foot okay so we have to make a sample raise up the pressure foot then insert the fabric okay turn on the machine and wait 10 seconds before pressing the threaded okay then use again the balance wheel to lower the needle and that is the right time for you to start sewing. After this, I'm done. By the way, guys, please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel.